Welcome back to Animal Revolt Battle Simulator. It's Battle of the Boxy Boos today. We've got three of these guys over here. I'm going to call this one Boxy Bear, though, because look at those arms and look at those claws. They're huge. He even has fur going on the back of his head. This one, I, Boxy Boy, I don't know. He looks like the youngest of the lot of them. And then this one, I'm calling him Boxy Burger. That looks like a burger face. To make this interesting, though, we've also got some humans. I don't know why these guys are here. They just showed up to watch the battle or something. But they're probably going to get wiped out. Let's face it. All right, guys, in we go. Oh, this one, he's just, like, ignoring the other boxy boos, and he's going straight for the humans. Just slap that guy. Angry Joe is now dead Joe. Oh, no. They're, like, uppercutting each other. That's intense. He's trying to bite, but I didn't even know if biting hurts him. How's their health going at the moment? Oh, like, they're barely even damaged. Barely. There's a good chance this could be an infinite battle. I'm not too sure, but I'm kind of hoping that boxy bear wins. Just because he looks the scariest. This guy over here is just being shot in the face repeatedly. She's like, I'm gonna get that burger. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna shoot it with a crossbow. Whoa! This guy has gone back to the battle. Boxy burger has arrived. Here comes a new challenger. I really hope there's a winner out of this. I just wanted to see who was gonna be the best. The very best, like no one ever was. Oh, that one's got a love heart on the back. Isn't that nice? He's apparently the friendliest of the lot of them. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, is anyone actually winning? At some point, I'm just gonna have to declare a winner. I feel like they're just hugging each other. They're just hugging it out. Except that one's biting the other one's neck. <laughs> that's a really strange way to hug somebody. Don't bite their neck to show affection, all right? Okay, it's been about a couple of minutes, and I have to say, Boxy Burger is the one who's losing the most. Hold up a second. I completely forgot about this guy. Giant Boxy Boo. Have you seen this thing? He has an alligator on the inside of him. That's the special move that one is. Okay, alrighty, guys. Let's go into the battle. Oh, man. Look at this guy. He's just picking off the humans, just like their snacks. They're little human nuggies. He's just picking them off the wall. Oh, this one's next. He's eyeing you off. You might want to turn around before he gets you. He's, he's not even doing anything. Do you even move these arms much? I just climbed in the tree there like I'm some kind of monkey. <laughs> Don't go in the tree, Finn. Don't do it. This guy's getting shot a little bit. He's getting shot. Okay. This human over here is doing... She just fell over. I was about to say she's doing okay, but she's really not. These guys are just back to hugging it out. They're really good friends. Dude, she's got explosive crossbows. Wow. Okay, I'm going to give these guys a little bit of a shove. See if I can get them back into the battle. Stop hugging. Stop it. Oh, there we go. All right, give them a good shove. They're over here by giant boxy boo, who was now just slapping them all over the place. He's playing them like some drums, and he's just screaming into the sky. He's like, <laughs> I don't even know what he's saying. Oh, they ran away again. Oh, you better run. He's coming for you. <laughs> What's going on with your legs? Oh my God. Oh my God. That is not how you walk. Oh, oh. It's the edge of the map. Don't walk off the map. Don't you know there's a boulder there? It's like she can't even see boulders. Oh, oh. Yeah, took her out. Awesome. Well done, Boxy Boo. Now he's just looking at the tree. Oh my god, these guys are weird. So I've been playing Stacks of Goat Simulator, and thankfully someone has made a goat. Look at this guy. He looks mega derpy. Looks like he's about ready to lick something. Maybe strap on a jetpack. Hopefully he's got jetpacks. I've got no idea. Alrighty, guys. Let's go. You know it's gonna be Goat versus Boxy Boo. This is gonna be really good. Oh yeah, the goat just stomped the humans. That's nice. Hasn't lost, lost any health yet. He's covered in feathers. A goat's covered in feathers? Is that a real thing? I don't know. I didn't know that about goats. But I don't know a lot about goats. I know that they scream like humans. Oh my god, what is he doing? <laughs> it's so embarrassing. This goat, he's just mega embarrassing. He's just kicking over these bricks. He's actually pretty tough. That waggle thing he's doing with his neck is really good at moving the bricks out of the way. Oh yeah, this is good. It's goat versus boxing. Goat just copped a slap to the face. Or is he boxing? Because he's, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to work with that joke. Okay. <laughs> just go with the goat. Come on, goat. Get in there. Oh, look at him just absorbing those punches. He's so strong. It must be that rubber neck he's got. Oh, he's getting right in there. What's he going to do? Oh, he's gotten past the arms. That was the weak spot. I think they might have forgotten to give the goat some kind of attacks. He's not doing anything. It seems like his attack is get stabbed, which, I don't know, that doesn't seem like an attack to me. Hey, champ, 
Do you want to try not getting stacked? It seems like Boxy's attacks are also terrible, but the goat is just no good at attacking Boxy, so it's another never-ending battle almost. Just gonna make a little bit of a hole in this wall. There we go. Bit of a blast from the past, we have the Holy Fist, Planet Fist, and Fistzilla. All right, guys, you have to do it. You have to take out Boxy Poo, the giant guy. Here we go, that's it. We need some health bars. Who's winning? Come on, Planet Fist is kinda, he's getting in there. He's trying, he's got all 1,000 of his fists. Oh, they're actually doing some damage on him. They're getting in there and doing some damage. I think he's gonna die. Planet Fist is just up here, just whacking him on the head. He's just slapping him right on the back of the head. He's doing a pretty good job. <laughs> What's going on over here? Planet Fist is kinda just, he's just stuck on the arm. He's just like really focused on that arm. Just like eating it or whacking it or something. I don't know what he's doing. Look at all these little fists going for it. They're so weird. Oh, it appears they've snapped his neck and they've exposed the box on the inside and they're just like pummeling it with lasers, I suppose. I forgot Fistzilla actually has a laser in his mouth. He's super strong. Of course he has a laser. Oh, I think Fistzilla is going to be the one to do it. Yes! They've done it! They've destroyed the giant boxy boo! Well done, champs! You can pack it up and go home. Go see your wife and kids. Over to our world-famous McGorilla restaurant we've got here. How's it going, champs? Look at these guys, working hard! This guy works so hard, his hat doesn't fit on his head. That's some serious logic. Hey, champs. <laughs> I see the wall staring is still going on. These guys are gonna be battling this. This is a tornado, apparently. Let's go. Let's go, it's apes versus tornado. Does this thing even work? How does it work? That doesn't look like any tornado I've seen before. All right, come on apes. What are you guys doing? Are you actually gonna fight? It looks like you just kind of stood out here dancing. Are you guys dancing? What are you even listening to? Oh, oh, oh it just sucked one up in there. <laughs> Where did that ape go? He just disappeared. How are these apes even dying? You're inside. You're protected from- Whoa, he just got shot in the face with the tornado. How does that even work? Does this tornado have guns? Okay, I've never heard of those before. Man, tornado is a serious business. <laughs> Come on, tornado. Do something. Destroy this building or something. Please. I feel like tornado needs a little bit of a hand, so we're sending in this guy. He's called Shoop De Whoop. Man, that is another blast from the past. Look at him, firing his laser. Well done, champ. Keep going. I think he's just shooting the inside of his own mouth. This guy is so bad. Come on, open your mouth a bit better than that, please. Oh my god. What's with these terrible creatures that do nothing? We have Tornado that can't even blow down a building. And Shoop the Whoop, who's just shooting his own lip. It is time to send in the almighty eyeball. It's called Seraphim. I don't know. Is it an angel? Who knows what this is? But it's on the team of the tornado and shoot to whoop for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah! Who won? I think they won. I think Team Tornado won. Finally. McGorilla is no more. Okay, this thing's pretty amazing. We have Killer Spider Queen versus Chainsaw T-Rex. Jeez, that thing looks aggressive. Look at it. Okay, let's go. My money's on Chainsaw T-Rex. That thing looks hardcore. It's got all the chainsaws on his arms and stuff. Clearly inspired by the anime. That's fine. That's fine. I even watched Chainsaw Man. But I'm all about the Chainsaw T-Rex. That dude was cool as heck. Look at him go. He's got on that Spider Queen. Spider Queen is called Killer Spider Queen. She appears to have crapped on the ground. Oh my god. Who won? Spider Queen has beaten Chainsaw T-Rex. I never thought that would happen. Alrighty, don't worry T-Rex. We got some goats on your team, champ. Two goats, as a matter of fact. <laughs> Two goats are better than one in every situation. Oh, the goats are dying as well. They're to- Oh, yeah. They managed to beat the spider this time. Is that spider dead? I think it's dead. I think they're just kicking the corpse around. Hey, he might have cool chainsaws, but that's pretty disrespectful. I feel a little bit bad for Killer Spider Queen. I feel- I, I do. I put more members on that team, I didn't put any on your team. So, she's brought her boyfriend along. Spider Guy. Alrighty, let's go. You don't want to mess with her boyfriend. He's back. And he's mad. And he's... Fallen over. It's- it's fine. He'll get back up again. And he'll help out. 
How much health does this guy have? I think he's got loads. I think he's got loads. Is he gonna win? I, I reckon he's gonna win. Maybe. Okay, I think he's dying. <laughs> Come on! Avenge her death! She's dead over there, I think. Or well, she's playing dead. I'm not sure. Come on, spider guy! Get those T-Rexes. No, he's totally dead as well. Look at this. He's inside the T-Rex's mouth. That is not somewhere you want to be if you want to win. That's not a winning move. Oh, he died. He was really just a regular human this whole time. With skeleton legs. And that's weird. <laughs> He's got an actual male torso, but skeleton everything else. No wonder he lost. So we did Battle of the Boxy Boos. Now we're going to be doing Battle of the Choo Choo Charles. There's a stack of these guys on the workshop. It's almost like he's popular or something. Look at this one. This one's actually pretty good. Except he's got big chunky wheels on this side and then itty bitty ones on this side. He's a bit lopsided. We've got this guy over here who is personally my favorite and picked to win. Look at it. He looks really, really good. I like his face. It's a beautiful face. Then we have this tiny one. It's like a Tic Tac. He's like bite-sized Charles. I don't think he's gonna win. I think he's just gonna get stepped on. And then this guy over here. I actually made this over a year ago. Barely anyone knew what Choo Choo Charles was at the time. But here he is, back with a vengeance. Alrighty, Charles, who's gonna win? Probably the one with the most health modifiers and damage modifier. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, okay. I think my Charles is a little bit OP. Well done, Charles. You just smashed him. I'll tell you what, though. My Charles has the best looking legs. Definitely looks more realistic. Look at these guys. They're just choo-choo chumps. I'm gonna get rid of them. You guys lose. You guys can choo-choo chill out back home. <laughs> and the ultimate battle, we have Choo-Choo Charles versus the Boxy Boos. Oh my god. Come on, dudes. I'm hoping he just comes in and just destroys these guys. Look at that. One touched him. Just like, uh, tapped him. Just tapped him a little bit. And the Boxy Boo's just dying. It was like it was nothing to him. Doesn't even care. You notice my Choo Choo Charles actually has a carriage at the back. This was like well before we even really knew what Choo Choo Charles looked like back there. It was just a teaser trailer back then. So this guy has a carriage. But the carriage is also full of crossbows. So he's really strong. Alright, who's winning? Oh yeah, Charles is definitely women. Women? Winning. <laughs> he's got a breakdown. Oh my god. He's doing okay. Charles is in it. He's in it for the long haul. Whoa! Unless he gets tossed off the map, you don't want that to happen. That'll ruin your day. Look at him, just going for like the little poke on the arm there. That's probably not what you want to attack. You want to attack the box here at the middle. That's where the health is. It's not even a little bit close. Charles has almost all of his health. He's at like 99% health, and he's just dominating the giant boxy boo here. Whoa! Whoa! whoa. No! No! <laughs> Who would have thought that would happen? Oh my god! He's even got a snapped neck! It's like upside down and everything! Boxy Boo actually won. That's incredible. 